Hello, welcome to Nagaland GK channel. Uh, in this channel, I'm providing Nagaland general knowledge quiz along with current affairs, which is based on multiple choice question. And this channel is also very useful for Nagaland state competitive exam and for your general knowledge awareness. And make sure that if you are new in this channel, please subscribe the channel. And also don't forget to press the bell icon so that you can easily update my videos whenever I upload. So, for today's video is based on Nagaland history, that is on MCQ. And this video is in part 1. So let's get started. So the first question is, who were the first European visitors to the Naga Hills? Option number A, Captain Mills and Captain J. Budler. Option B, Captain J. Budler and R.B. Bemberton. And option C, Captain F. Jenkins and Captain John Budler. And option D, Captain Francis Jenkins and R.P. Pemberton. And here, the correct answer is option number D, that is Captain Francis Jenkins and R.P. Pemberton. And the next question is, who were referred to as free Nagas during British rule? Option number A, Naga tribe who made a bag with the British accepting the latter's rule. Option B, Naga tribes living in Moon and Dunsang districts of present-day Nagaland. Option C, Nagas who were converted to Christianity. Option D, Nagas who survived the battles with the British. And here, the correct answer is option number B, that is, Naga tribes living in Moon and Dunsang district of present-day Nagaland. And the next question is, which battle in history is referred to as the Stalingrad of the East? Option number A, Battle of Kikruma. Option number B, Battle of Imphal. Option number C, Battle of Koima. Option number D, Battle of Rancun. There, the correct answer is option number C, that is Battle of Koima. And the next question is, which battle is considered the final resistance of the Nagas to the British? Option number A, Battle of Konama. Option B, Battle of Mitsubishi. C, Battle of Jotsuma. Option D, Battle of Kurosawa. And here the correct answer is option number A, that is Battle of Konama. And the next question is, Koima World War II Symmetry is being maintained by Option A, Kapital War Graves Commission. Option B, European War Committee. Option C, British War Council. Option D, UK Foreign Affairs. And here the correct answer is Commonwealth War Graves Commission. was fought between option number A, April 10, 1944 and June 20, 1944, option B, April 4, 1944 and June 22, 1944, and option C, April 15, 1944 and June 26, 1944, and option D, April 13, 1944 and June 27, 1944. And here the correct answer is Goyima was fought between option num the correct answer is option number B that is April 4, 1944 and June 22, 1944. And the next question is the British adopted the policy of policy of non-intervention with the Hill Bibles affairs in the year option number A 1850, option number B 1851, option number C 1849 and option number D 1852. And here the correct answer is option number B, that is 1851. And the next question is, the interim body of Nagaland was integrated on February 18th by option number A, J.B. Singh, option number B, General S.M. Srinagesh, and option C, Dr. Radhakrishna, and option D, Akbar Hyderi. Hyderi. And here the correct answer is option number B, that is General S.M. Srinagesh. And the next question is, who was the last British administrator of the Naga Hills? Option number A, Sir D.C. Hudson. Option number B, Sir Charles Bowsey. Option number C, Sir J.B. Mills. Option number D, Sir J.H. Hudson. And here, the correct answer is option number B. That is, Sir Charlie's Posse. And the next question is, 
who was the name of the political officer who was shot dead along with 35 of his escort in the Battle of Konama in 1879. And this is the last question for today's videos. And option number A is Captain J John Butler and option number B, Guy Bon Henry Daman. Option number C, Captain Francis Jenkins and option number D, Lieutenant Robert Pemberton. And here the correct answer is option number B, that is Guy Bon Henry Daman. So thank you, thank you for watching my videos and if you like my videos and get something from these videos, please subscribe the channel and also don't forget to press the bell icon so that you can easily update my videos whenever I upload. So see you in the next videos.